And we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you the symmetrical painting function. Most people don't know there is a function in build in GIMP. You can for example use the brush and if you want to draw a heart you can see I don't have the best hand for that. And it's not symmetrical, let me press Ctrl Z. We can use an embed function under Windows, Docker Dialogs, there's the symmetric painting menu, just click on it. By default it's set to none, so if I draw something there is no symmetry in it. But we can set it to mirror, for example use a horizontal mirror. And this is what happens now. You can also set it to vertical or central symmetry. Still not a good heart, but definitely better than my first try. You can also use a tiling function. You want to, for example, create a pattern. And the mandala, it gives you horizontal and vertical symmetry. So you can create these typical mandala inspired patterns here. Let me just give you a quick example. The functions up here, we have the center position and we can adjust it with the two sliders in the x and y axis. So the first one here is for horizontal, second one is for vertical. And we also have number of points. Let me detach this menu, I drag it here, now I have six points. Let me make it nine and you get more and more points of symmetry. And this is basically all there is to know about the basics of this symmetry painting function in GIMP. I hope this video was helpful, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.